I'm Ginger from Wahoo, here to chat with you about the brand new Kicker Bike Shift. Wahoo is the global leader of indoor training, and we've once again revolutionized your indoor cycling experience with Kicker Bike Shift. Kicker Bike Shift offers the same unmatched ride feel of the Kicker Bike. In a powerfully efficient design, it is ready to ride. Kicker Bike Shift's drivetrain provides a smooth and virtually silent riding experience, even when throwing down 2200 watt sprints. Let's walk through some of the key features of the new Kicker Bike Shift. The all new Kicker Bike Shift features new Wi-Fi Connectivity Plus, Kicker Direct Connect Port, Erg Easy Ramp for smooth ramps from a dead stop, a new odometer to track your trainer's usage, Wi-Fi LED, and automatic firmware updates. Kicker Bike Shift is for all those cyclists riding and are training indoors. It offers many of the benefits of Kicker Bike, but in a budget-friendlier version. Before lifting out of the box, you will actually attach one of the rear legs while it is in this position. In order to do that, you will need your five millimeter hex wrench, as well as two of the hex screws. Slide the foot into the base, and you can see the foot here will eventually be what is in contact with the floor. Line up the holes, and then place the screws just gently in with a couple turns to line it up, and then you can start to tighten them. Please make sure that you have secured both screws from the base of the bike into the rear leg before lifting out of the box. Now that they are secure, you are ready to go grab your friend. Now that you have your buddy with you, you can each come to one side of the bike to lift out of the box. From here, you can each get a remaining leg. Here for the front, and one for the back, and slide into their appropriate slots. Line up the holes, and place each of the remaining six bolts, four into the front leg, and two into the remaining rear leg. Time for your handlebars. Simply adjust and loosen this quick release before sliding the bars into the frame. Once you have an approximate height, tighten, and the bars at this point should be level. If you need, use a four millimeter Allen wrench to gently loosen, but do not remove the stem bolts on the faceplate. Rotate the handlebars to your desired position and evenly re-tighten the stem bolts on the faceplate evenly in a figure eight pattern. Adjust the torque to five newton meters. Connecting the shifter cable into the pod. It has a specific shape that will match up and magnetically attach. Time for the saddle. First, loosen the rear quick release. Place the saddle into the base and tighten the quick release. If you do not know your saddle height right now, no problem. We're going to come back to that later. Next, it is time to attach the pedals according to the crank length of your bike fit. Pedals are not included with the kicker bike shift, so you'll need to provide your own. The Kicker Bike Shift crank arm is designed to customize your fit with options of length. You can select 165, 167.5, 170, 172.5, or 175 millimeters based on the corresponding holes in the crank arm. When attaching your pedals to the Kicker Bike Shift crank arm, be sure that you've properly identified the left from the right pedal. 
apply a bit of grease to the threads. If you know your crank arm length, make sure you attach your pedals into the corresponding hole for that length. If you don't know your crank length, we will give you a recommendation during your fit. Thread your pedals into the crank using the washer if needed for correct spacing. Use a wrench to ensure a snug and secure fit. Once the bike is assembled, open the Wahoo Fitness app to dial in the Ride Feel experience. Pair the bike to the app via Bluetooth. Once paired, the app will take you through a series of options to customize the shifting, gear sets, and fit of the bike, starting with simulated shifting. You can choose between Shimano Di2, Campy, or SRAM ETAP, or mechanical gears. Starting with your front gearing, you can choose between one, two, or three chain rings, as well as how many teeth each has. For the cassette, you can choose traditional nine, 10, 11, or 12 speed, or enter in a custom range if you ride something more specific. The final part of the customization is to go through one of the fit processes to see how to adjust the kicker bike shift for the most accurate sizing, and then adjust as prompted. There are two different ways to get fit for the kicker bike shift, and I will walk you through them now. The Kicker Bike Shift has updated saddle and bar quick releases for easier to use and more secure than the Kicker Bike options. The frame, setback, and reach adjusters have been redesigned to work with the new frame. The Kicker Bike 5 Point Quick Release System offers a great solution for multi rider households and on the fly adjustments. Option number one. Guru Fit Numbers. If you have gotten a pro fit done by a shop or your local fitter, you will have Guru or Retool Numbers. You'll place these numbers into the app in their appropriate spots. Once all filled in, the app will calculate your comparable measurements on the kicker bike shift. Option two is to fill in your height and pant inseam, as well as choose your preferred position between race endurance, and relax. Based on these indicators, the app will calculate and give you your comparable measurements in kicker bike shift terms. Whichever way you choose, once the app has given you your fit, it will store it in your profile for future reference. Let's head over to your kicker bike shift and dial it in. It's important to stay connected. The Kicker Bike Shift offers all the Wi-Fi connectivity options of the most recent Kicker Bike and Kicker. Let's check out the Wi-Fi connectivity option. Wi-Fi connectivity offers a more robust training connectivity solution for your home. Wi-Fi offers lower latency and higher throughput, expanding the capabilities of what our trainer can do. Through the Wahoo app or system device management, you can connect your trainer to the network, very similar to how Element configures Wi-Fi. At Wahoo, we like to stay connected. So with the new Wi-Fi LED, you'll know exactly when your new kicker is ready to go and connected. Similar to Bluetooth LED, it helps the user quickly understand the connection status of the trainer. The LED will slow blink white when searching for a network. Fast blink means it's discovered the network and working to connect. Solid white means the trainer has a good connection to the network. Another connectivity type that we've added to the new kicker bike shift is the Direct Connect port. The Direct Connect port requires use of the Direct Connect adapter. With that adapter, you are now able to directly connect your kicker bike shift to your router 
to wired connection without interference. Now, no matter your environment, you've got a connectivity solution for you. ERG Easy Ramp is also carried over for kicker bike shift. It allows the user to easily transition into a high target wattage after a dead stop. It can be difficult to ramp up to a target wattage after a dead stop, but this makes it much easier. If you have to stop due to kids or pets or a knock at the door, when you come back to your trainer, the kicker easy ramp will help you in 10 seconds ease back up to that target wattage and cadence. The all new odometer on the kicker bike shift allows you to track the overall usage of your trainer. It tracks the number of times the crank revolves on the trainer and computes total mileage based on those revolutions. Part of evolving for our Wahoo ecosystem is ensuring that our products are continually being updated. We are happy to announce that the Kicker Bike Shift involves automatic firmware updates. If you're like me, you don't have time to check the app to see if your latest version of firmware is available. Now you don't have to. Kicker Bike Shift will automatically download and install new firmware when available on our cloud. At night, when the trainer is idle, it will check the cloud to see if a new version of the firmware is available. If one is, it'll download the file and install it. There's a lot that goes into creating a new training revolution. That's all you should need to know about the Kicker Bike Shift. Thanks for watching. Until next time.